are you preoccupied with finding the truth to questions, the answers to questions, the realizations and recognitions to questions that really don't matter to you? because that's an enormous waste of time and energy. And what happens is because we're preoccupied with the thoughts, we're living inside of our head and thinking about ourselves and trying to make sense of and trying to make decisions because of this pressure, what that can lead to is a lot of mental anxiety. The pressure to make sense of things, if you're trying to figure out what the heck's going on and make mental decisions, that's nerve wracking. That's anxiety producing. Okay, we're gonna talk more about the Ashna Center next week and where that pressure is going. But remember, this is the most important thing to remember. With an undefined head center, our center for inspiration and what's interesting. If it's undefined, you are preoccupied with questions, concerns, and worries that don't matter. And you know, on the short version of all these slides and images, the people that don't matter, it says don't matter. But what specifically, more specifically, it really doesn't matter to you. And if you're trying to initiate the answer to everybody else's questions, figure everything out, you're trying to initiate vocal communication, what tends to happen is due to brain fog or whatever else, you lose focus. So you know that thing where you do, you're like, oh, what was I gonna say? You're in the middle of a talking in a stream and, and, and all of a sudden they start talking and you start talking and, and you're like, wait, what? <laughs> you know, they're just like, what the hell just happened? The losing focus is a sign that you're preoccupied with questions that don't matter to you. So the moment you lose focus, you can, unless you have some kind of like gut disorder and you're eating gluten and you're really allergic to grain or gluten, you know, or any of the chemicals they put on regular food, if you're allergic to that, that can also cause brain fog. But other things can also cause brain fog, and that is trying to force energy out your mouth or to process energy that has no consistent flow. So if there's no consistent flow and you're losing focus, it's a sign that shit don't matter, okay? So you can just let go of that thought and not think, oh my God, there's something wrong with me, unless, you know, do get yourself tested if you have any allergies, food allergies that can be very damaging to the gut, which is da damaging to the cognition and the brain. So all of you I mentioned earlier, I want you to ask yourself these questions, okay? If you recognize these questions that I'm gonna ask you, that's something to be concerned about because if you're making decisions because of those questions, that's what's leading you to frustration, anger, bitterness, disappointment. Okay, so I want you to notice this week what your mind is saying or telling you about your own life. I have to find the answers. I have to know what's going on. Notice how your mind is always gonna try and make decisions. Well, I'm not sure if that's gonna happen, so maybe if I go over here and do this thing, then, then I'm gonna get what I want. Or I'm not sure what that meant, and maybe I have to go and get some you know, therapy to make sure that I can make sense of this experience that I had, and you know, if it's just from mind, it's not important. Not right here, not right now. So notice that mental dialogue and how it relates to your not self open centers. So maybe I need to go find something interesting. I have to have a book, I have to have a magazine, I have to look at stuff because this is very visual up here. Or listen to stuff. Maybe you can't go to sleep without listening to something. You know, you have to, you can't have silence for whatever reason. Um, I have to find the answer to my question, so I have to download all these podcasts and I have to take all these classes because I need to find the answer. Who has the answer? Does Levina have the answers? Does human ha design have the answer? Who has those answers? I need to have them. That's what the transit is telling us right now because the earth is there in the gate four, which is about answers. So we have to understand this. We have to make sense of this. We have to be certain that this is what it means. Who can I go to talk to? Where can I go? to talk to somebody who knows who has the freaking answers. So that happens, right? Can you anybody relate with that? Losing focus, you're on the internet, you're trying to figure out what the heck and where are we going and what's going on and oh, you know, what's that song? <laughs> and you're just wasting time and energy with shit that doesn't matter. So if you can take a deep breath and go, okay, I'm losing focus. That's tough inside of my head, that's not really me who I am. 